Schools all across the country are opening this week, but in one of Pennsylvania's poorest districts, hundreds of teachers return today not knowing when their next paycheck will come. Jerika Duncan is there. Happy New Year! Happy New a bell ringing Year! ceremony Year! marked the start of a new school year in Chester, Pennsylvania. But it's the school district's financial problems that are alarming to parents like Tracy Howell. It's the second time in three years she's seen teachers working without knowing when they will get paid. This year, it seems like it's a lot worse than it's been in the previous years. This year, the Chester Upland School District is $22 million in the red, but this is nothing new. Every year since 2004, it's overspent an average of more than $20 million, mainly due to fiscal mismanagement and a surge in local charter schools. Half the district's children now attend charters, and that takes state funding away from the public schools. It's all about our students. It's Special education teacher Daria Jackson. How long are you prepared to work without a paycheck? Um, I haven't come up with a specific date. Two weeks, three weeks, four weeks? Months. You're willing to go months? Yes. Superintendent Gregory Shannon, who was hired to reform the district in 2013, says he isn't getting paid either. Governor Tom Wolf said that for the last 25 years, this district has mismanaged its finances. What do you say to that? Um, I would agree. Yeah, um, Governor Wolf is correct in so much as our district has had a long history of financial challenges. As politicians scramble to find a solution, a community continues to worry about the future of its children. If we don't educate them now, we incarcerate them later. So what do we do? The teachers and staff here won't get paid until state lawmakers pass a budget. Scott, that was supposed to happen two months ago. Jerika Duncan. Thanks, Jerika.